have been doing this, bitch. I'm, excuse me. I was supposed to do this uh, video um, yesterday, but I didn't get a chance to. So I said I'm going to react to it today. So I'm reacting to Escape, uh, Nasty Drum, Natasha versus Candy, Tamika, and Tiny. Well, I don't know. That way win. I'm going to say that way win. Natasha and Candy always had drama. The group itself had always really had drama. They were always fist fighting hard and stuff, but mainly. Latasha Candy. Latasha will always want to be the sneaky one to go behind people back and try to get a solo career. So they stayed out for a while and they hadn't even been singing or nothing. So they ended up getting back together. True kind of told, Tiny was the one allegedly pulled them back together. Said that she wanted the group to get back together. So, Candy allegedly didn't want to do it. Allegedly. But she did. You know, because Tiny and Candy have had business ventures. You know, of course, everybody knows that. Tiny had a uh, family hustle, you know, then, you know, other adventures. Then Tiny and Candy have a son on several tracks together. They wrote uh, several uh, EPs for uh, TLC. So, I'm going to tell you somehow, I knew something was right. At the Soul Train Award, all of them was dressed sort of just like in the same color gowns. It was, it, it was just made different, but it was pretty. The only wasn't the only one wasn't made like that was Latasha. Latasha gown was green. Yeah. Apparently came to find out that allegedly the designer of that design Tasha Cole tried to get in contact with the designer that did Tamika, Tiny, and Candy. But there was no answer. And y'all know that's bogus. I don't believe it. So, it was a falling out. Supposed to be, allegedly, because of um. Tamika's husband. Him and the promoter had gotten to it. But it was the other way around. They said that he got into it with the promoter. The promoter didn't get into it with him. So, you know, usually I said Tamika. That was uh, Latasha. Latasha was all this drunk. <clears throat> Her sister name is Tamika. I'm sorry, y'all. So Tamika usually stand by her sister, but Tamika said, no, not this time, sis. Latasha wants to go solo, you know, because the only thing she's ever been, excuse me, y'all, that was my only thing she's ever really been named for was group escape, the escape, which I can understand, you know, sometimes, you know, but why now after all these years where y'all just not getting back on track, y'all just not getting back on making money. So, they allegedly Posta came together because of Carlo King, you know, the producer of Love and Mary Sunfield. He's supposed to be, as Candy said, made a movie about him, a reality show. And they were seeing, Latasha said, 
if anybody should tell their life story, it should be them. So that's why how they supposedly end up getting that together. So, to make a long story short, um, I guess it was some kind of on stage, they phenomenal. When they hit that stage, they focus. When they get off that stage, it's nothing but drama. So, I guess it was drama. And I guess it came to a boil to where they just didn't want to deal with it no more. Because it always, the same thing that's happening now with the solo career, that's the same thing happened way back when with Latasha. The only difference is now the sister is not standing behind her sister because she's seen you doing this all over again. You know, it's like they seen allegedly one time, okay. Twice, no. I can always tell you, look at you and tell you that she was drunk. Latasha was drunk. Last time when her and Candy fell out, uh, Candy and Tamika fell out as, as well. And Candy and Tamika, which is her sister, was very close. But because Latasha and Tamika's sister, Tamika stood by her sister. As you should. But as you know as now, things are different. And it's like all three of them into it now. It's like Latasha, Candy, Tamika, and Tiny is into it. Tamika, Candy, and Tiny is into it with Latasha. Um, I think they are always love each other. I think they'll always be a sisterhood. I think they'll always be love for one another. But I think that when it comes to Latasha, she's a lot of drama. That's what's going around the internet. Because, you know, I don't too much like to react on this case because I don't too much know nothing about them. But when I seen this episode, I said, I got to do this video. And so that just made me do this video. And not only this, I think Latasha husband name is right. And supposedly he have a baby out there. That's the other thing that's worth. A mess. It's a mess. If I tell you, Latasha got it going on. It's supposed to be because they have a uh, movie coming. Everything that's going on, you know, because they have to break. They have to create drama so the movie can, you know, kick off. And so, from what I understand, Latasha already got an album surfing. And it's already in motion. And, um, uh, I don't know. Who knows what it's going to do? Who knows what it's going to make? Only thing we could do is just sit back and wait and watch. But it, it seemed like they such a, a good group and they sing together, they harm together. Because they did real good for the Soul Train Music Award. Like, they won the Lady Soul Award. And they was being honored for that. So, you know, they won it. And to make a long story short, they do well together. 
So you would never in a million years think that that group there is a um, that group there is a uh, um um on bad things. But when I seen that they were, I was just like, I was just like surprised. Yeah. Hold on, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, but I'm going to search the internet right now and to see what if I can uh, hold on, yeah, about this. Yeah, y'all, I was right. It said escape fusion again. Who saw this now? They seen this time. It's Latasha Power. It is saying everybody is blaming Latasha because they beefing over the same thing. It's just like it's Latasha's fault. You know what I'm saying? But it, you can tell it's Latasha's fault because she 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 know what she be doing. Latasha threw shots at Candy. Latasha Shay was thick at the Soul Train Award. Candy versus Tasha, you know what I'm saying? And that's, I mean, that's just sad. Escape drama. Who's behind this? Latasha Scott. Smear campaign, you know? That's just her. You know, that's just what she do. Um, she loves to store drama. You know, I've never actually been a fan of hers. I just never really just opted to be being a fan of hers because she always doing too much. She also do she always doing too much. You know what I'm saying? You know, um, the day of the, when they was in Vegas, Latasha was supposed to show up for the, the rehearsal. So, Latasha didn't even show up for the rehearsal. She showed up at the rehearsal late. So, this should let you know. Latasha is the the root of the escape drum is between the sisters, Latasha and Tamika. And, you know, I think it just comes. Tiny thank you to my my girl. I love y'all. And, you know, Tiny is, you know, she's always have been the one, you know, to be the peacemaker, but you know, It's different, but it's the same thing. Like I told y'all before, Candy confronts Latasha about her solo, and this was five years ago, and, and it's like she doing it again. The real reason Latasha is not performing with Escape is because they say Latasha got her own uh, um Solo career, but it's always like that, you know. And it said escapes Latasha Sock called Candy and Sister Tamika liars. So, you know, come on, girl, everybody ain't gonna lie on you. And then Tiny Candy Slap fought me and Fist fought Latasha before it escaped. So, it, it had been, it's been a lot. I ain't got. And then T.I. says, I ain't got nothing missing to say. Speak on Escape after there. You know what I'm saying? But, and then Latasha from Escape, husband, has a baby on the way with his mistress. Child, I tell you, Latasha, like, her whole life is just about messiness. You understand what I'm saying? So, but... 
they was honored. Uh, Escape is honored with the 2022 Soul Train Lady of Soul Award. It was about four days ago. Uh, they was honored after Thanksgiving, which was Saturday. Uh, they saw, understand, they cut up. It was good. It was really, really, really good. I really enjoyed it. But I'm going to get off of here. And uh, I want to just, I wanted, I, I wanted to come to report that to y'all. Bye.